In this video, we'll go through exam questions that cover the criteria, describe and make comparisons in words between measures of items including size, length, width, height, weight, and capacity. You can locate the questions on the MassMath.com website under Entry 1. The questions come from different exam boards. We'll start with the non-calculated questions and then we'll move to the calculated questions. However, for this topic, you don't really need to use a calculator, even if the question appears in the calculator exam part. Here's the first question. Evie has these chocolate bars. Which chocolate bar is the biggest? Take your answer. So there we have four chocolate bars. The biggest of them all is this one, B. The rest of them are smaller. Rosie and her mum go shopping for a new school uniform. Rosie chooses the longer skirt. Which skirt does she choose? Tick your answer. So out of all of these, this one is the longest, as you can see, up to here, whereas this one is shorter, this one is shorter as well, and this one is also shorter than this. So B is the only correct option. Which one of the following statements is true? Tick one. Student X is shorter than student Z. Let's have a look. Here is student X. Is she shorter than student Z? No, that's not correct. Student Y is taller than student X. No, that's not correct. Student Y is shorter. Student Z is taller than student Y. Student Z is taller than student Y. That's correct. And then finally, student X is shorter than student Y. That's not correct either. So the only correct option is option C. Take the longest table. So we've got these lengths. Table B is the longest. We've got jug A and jug B. So we've got to choose the correct words to finish the sentence. Jug A has the same amount of water as jug B. Is that correct? No, it's not. It's not the same amount. Jug A has less water than jug B. That's correct. This is lower than this. Jug A has more water than jug B. That's not correct. And jug A has an equal amount of water to jug B, which is incorrect. So the only correct option is option B. The craft shop has a delivery of wooden ducks. The ducks are all different heights. 13 centimetres, 8 centimetres, 5 centimetres, 20 centimetres and 14 centimetres. Write these heights in order. Start with the biggest first. So, as they're all in centimetres, we're going to focus on the number. So, 13, 8, 5, 20 and 14. So, which one is the highest of them all? The highest is 20. Then, we'll come 14. After 14, we'll have 13. Then we have 8. And then 5. So, they go down. If you want to check, you could go this way. So you could do, starting from 1, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 
9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So they are in order. 12 kilograms is the same as 14 kilograms. That's not correct. 12 kilograms is lighter than 14 kilograms. That is correct. 12 kilograms is heavier than 14 kilograms. That's not correct. And 12 kilograms is more than 14 kilograms, which is not correct. So the only correct option is B. We now move into the calculator questions, but again, we don't really need to use a calculator for these type of questions, for this topic. Lila needs a pan. She chooses a pan that holds the most. Which pan does Lila choose? Tick the correct answer. So which one holds the most? So we've got 12 litres, 16 litres, 10 litres and 15 litres. So they all in litres, so that means we need to focus on the number 12, 16, 10 or 15. If you can't spot this straight away and go to 16 litres, you could start counting from 1. So go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 is the last one. So 16 holds the most. 16 is the highest number and that means that this pot holds the most. Rita plans a fun run at the sports centre. People choose the distance they want to run. Jack will run the shortest distance. Which distance will Jack run? So we've got 8 kilometres, 14 kilometres, 11 kilometres and 5 kilometres. As they're all in kilometres, we only need to focus on the numbers 8, 14, 11 and 5. Shortest distance means that we're looking for the smallest number here. Which one is the smallest? So if we start counting from 1, that would be the first number that we read. So we go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So 5 is here. That's the shortest. All the other numbers represent longer distances. Three buses are in the bus station. Which is the longest bus? Tick your answer. So we've got these three buses. As you can see, this one is the longest, this one is slightly shorter and this one is even shorter. So the longest one is D. Rob parks the moped. He parks in the widest space. Which is the widest space? Tick your answer. So comparing these this one is the widest. The rest of them are narrower. There are some pictures on a wall. Alex cleans the widest picture. Which picture does Alex clean? Take your answer. So, comparing again, C is the widest. Alicia looks at a column and a bowl in the museum. The column and the bowl are made of the same type of stone. What does Alicia say? Tick your answer. The column is heavier than the bowl. Yes, it's heavier because it's much bigger. The column is lighter than the bowl, which is not correct. The bowl and the column weigh the same. No. The bowl is heavier than the column. That's not correct. So the only correct option is A.
these bottles of washing up liquid were in the delivery. Which bottle can hold the most washing up liquid? Tick your answer. So the one that is the biggest will hold the most. And that's D. The rest are smaller and shorter as well. Evie puts some bottles of water on a shelf. She puts the tallest bottle at the back of the shelf. Which bottle does Evie put at the back of the shelf? Tick your answer. So which one is the tallest? That's C. The rest of them are shorter. Fez looks at computer screens in a shop. He buys the widest screen. Which screen does Fez buy? So, comparing, C is the widest, the rest are narrower. Fez looks at these printer cables. What does he say? Take your answer. Cable 1 is shorter than cable 3. Let's have a look. That's not correct. Cable 2 is longer than cable 3. Cable 2 is longer than cable 3. That's correct. Looking at C, cable 3 is longer than cable 1. That is not correct. And cable 4 is the shortest. No, the shortest is cable 3. So the only correct option is option B. The tracksuit is in the widest parcel. Which parcel is the tracksuit in? Take your answer. So the widest, let's have a look. That's B. The rest are narrower. Rosie and her mum look at pencil cases. Rosie buys the largest pencil case. Which pencil case does Rosie buy? Take your answer. So looking at them, this one is the largest. The rest of them are smaller. So D is the correct option. Rosie puts her poster on the shortest stand. Which stand does she put her poster on? Tick your answer. So the shortest of them all is D. The rest of them are taller. Dylan fills buckets with water. Which bucket has the least amount of water? Tick your answer. Looking at the level of water, C is representing the least amount of water. So bucket C has the least amount of water. Which horse has the longest tail? Tick your answer. Longest tail. That's B. Dylan gets these two saddles. Saddle 1 and saddle 2. What does Dylan say about the saddles? Saddle 1 is larger than saddle 2. That's not correct. Saddle 1 is the same size as saddle 2. Again, that's not correct. Saddle 2 is smaller than saddle 1. Again, that's not correct. Because saddle 2 is bigger, is larger. Saddle 2 is larger than saddle 1. So the only correct option is option D. Dylan rides the tallest horse. Which is the tallest horse? Tick your answer. So tallest of them all is C. Which one of these roads is the narrowest? Tick one. So the narrowest 
is D. The rest of them are wider. A customer wants to buy a plate to paint. She wants to paint the biggest plate. She sees these plates. Tick which plate she will buy. So the biggest of them all is this one here. The rest are smaller. The woman pays with this note. £20. How much change will she get? Put units on your answer. So she pays with £20. And the plate costs £10. So we're doing 20, take away 10, which gives us 10. So 10 pounds. We need to include the pound sign. Which one of the following statements is true? Tick one. Cake X is bigger than cake Y. Is it bigger than cake Y? No. Cake Y is smaller than cake Z. No, it's bigger than cake Z. Cake Y is bigger than cake X. That's right. And cake Z is smaller than cake X. That's not correct either. So the only correct option is C. Here are four cars. A customer wants to buy the smallest car to fit in his garage. Which car should he buy? So the smallest out of them four is car B. The rest of them are bigger. So we're going to tick car B. Which item is the heaviest? Tick the item. So we've got four of them. The first one weighs four kilograms, the second five kilograms, the third two kilograms, and the last one seven kilograms. So they're all in kilograms, that means we've got to focus on the number four, five, two, and seven. What we're looking for is the item that is the heaviest. So we're looking for the greatest number, the biggest number out of this four. So if you start counting, that would be the last one that you say, the last number that you say. So if you start from one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So seven is the last one, that's the heaviest. So we're going to tick this one. There are five trees in the garden. They are all different heights. Put the trees in order of height in the table below. Start with the shortest tree. So looking at the height of the trees, this one is the shortest. So E is the shortest. Then we have D. Then we have B. Then we have A. And finally C. And this is the end of the questions.